thing today. It's going to take a couple parts, but we're going to get through it. There's a lot of really nice transition parts and uh, a lot of nice flary inversions Bob does behind Jerry during the verses. So let's get right into it. This version that we're doing is um, 72687 Anaheim. They go right into it right there. Alright, so this beginning part is little. So with this little inversion of G without the bass, just pick your pinky on the 15th. So it starts on the 12th. G. And then cancel out the bar on the B string with the pinky note on the B string on the 15th and then put your ring finger on the 14th fret basically just restarting these variations down here and then you hammer on the okay yeah that's the verse so we're not gonna get to that yet so the beginning of this is just that 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 variation arpeggio it you can either put the or you can just in these live versions, he puts in the on the studio. You'll hear the but in the live versions, he goes. So let's do that again, and then we'll go into the verse. G to the F. Can you see that? And from this F, slide into the G instead of sliding out of it and go. And emphasize this five note. On the F, it's the 13th. On the G, it's the 15th. So when you slide into the, the G right there, let my inspiration, you're hitting the G. So. My inspiration. D minor is a chord, but you're doing the this variation of D. D minor. From the G, you just hammer on the your ring finger to the 14th. Makes it that D, that D chord. This finger's just droning. So let my inspiration flow. I can ride just sing. So the melody he's trying to do it. He's doing the, the chords based on this melody. Okay, so it's G, D, D minor, C. So it's basically just doing these inversions down here, just doing the full you have that 12th fret to do the bar. So G, E minor, C, and then G again without the without the five note on the 15th. So just this one because you just did this and the C. So so all together it's. So five flat five five on the on the F. I will not forsake 
You can either do hammer on that C after the F, just like you do in the G and the D. F, C. You can either do that, that F, and then do go down to this C. So yeah, let's just do it right here. So after he he does that uh Right there, it's a quick F, and after the C, so it's like, uh, I will not forsake thee till my tale is told and done. Right after it, that F, and then you go the <clears throat> ninth to the seventh on the B string, and then on the G string, eighth to ninth, G chord, back to the beginning. You could either do kind of that's like the end and you restart at this G. I've seen him do that in the videos too, so we'll go through the verse and you'll see what I'm talking about. Each verse is is different, so there's two there's two parts to the verses. That's the first part and we'll go through it. Alright, yeah, let's go a little bit more. Lot to explain. <laughs> Appreciate you guys watching. Second part of the verse, so it's it's while the fire the beginning part's the same. While the fire lights a glow, train shadows from the flames will grow. Do things we've never seen. See from the So this is the little the same as the beginning part. Seem familiar, you're on the F. F major 7 back to the 1. You can do this one. Or whichever one you choose. He does both of them. So um, so that's the little gist of that. So the end of the, of the second part of the verse. The seam, So the first one is the and then the second the next part of the verse is always So it kind of alternates from that. So it's like, we'll go through it and you'll see what I'm talking about of each little part of the verse is different like that. But those are the two parts of it. So we'll now back to the first one.
second one. So it's kind of just the gist of the verses. So you just do, do, do these two parts over and over again. But my, my video's about to cut out. So we're going to do a part two and we're going to pick up right here.